Tricasa Porto is the main seaside of the municipal territory. Already present in the documents of the 14th century, the port consists of a natural inlet, where in its interior flow several water sources. During the 20th century, the port area was enlarged and today it is enlivened by the boats of foreign tourists, local fishermen and associations. Among the most evocative activities, the Magna Grecia Maria Association has brought back to life a 100-year-old cake in order to valorize the traditional navy and recover the ancient use of the Latin sail. As in the past, still today the fishmen from Tricase are dedicated to their productive activities, offering, among other things, various innovative reception services linked to the tourism, to the excursions in the cave and to the typical home cooking. Moving instead under the slopes of the promontory Calino, you reach Marina Serra. The landscape is dominated by the ancient Torre Palane, coastal fortress built in the 16th century to defend the territory from enemy attacks from the sea. Torre Palane communicated to the south with Torre Nasparo, of the municipality of Tigiano and to the north with now vanished Torre de Porto of Tricase, demolished by the British fleet in the early 19th century. Particular is the Piscina dei Monaci, an artificial inlet built for the baths of the Dominican friars of the convent and enlarged in the 20th century. A place with a pleasant landscape. The seaside attracts many vacationers and tourists during the summer. In the warm months, at first light from down, from the coast of Marina Serra, it is easy to see several schools of dolphins intent on elegantly furrowing the blue waters of the Otonto Canal. This series of characteristics of the marine of Tricasa allows visitors to enjoy a splendid panorama, enjoying the scent of saltiness while immersed in the vegetation of the cliff and the blue of the crystalline sea.